Yeah. Thank you. Now then we're going to look at a technology which could be the future of identification and security in this country. We're joined by security expert Roberto Fiorentino and welcome yes. Roberto. Thank you Hi. very much indeed. Morning, so what it? is the name of the technology? Oh, I'm going under so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Just dance the, te the technology is known as Fast Vein. Um, fast vein. Fast vein. It's a biometric uh, method of reading or identifying humans, rather like iris scan or fingerprint. The difference here is we're shining near infrared light through the top of the finger and we are photographing a picture of the veins underneath. So this is more accurate than a, a fingerprint? Mm, vastly more accurate. Um, in terms of if you line up 30,000 people on a fingerprint access control system, one of them will get a false positive. You'll need at least a million people to get past this with just one false uh, identification. Can you show me how it works? Absolutely. Um, the point of this is it's very fast, it's very efficient, and it's uh, very cost effective. All we have to do is just type in your uh, surname into here and your first name. Mm -hmm. And if we go over to job and put in this morning and presenter, that is the details that we need for the system. Yep. And then we need to take your photograph. So if we just grab a photo... This is a face photo. Yes, it is. And there's your photo done. Mm -hmm. Now we're going to scan your finger. Um, you can scan any number of digits, but uh, if we take your uh, right index finger and you've got it in the scanner there, scan captured. Quick as that. And that's you done. So this is why it's very fast. Well, how, what would you use this in, though, then? Um, in terms of access control systems into buildings, oh. uh, we currently have this operating. Uh, it's been tested for 14 months in the intensive care unit at Southampton University Hospital. Uh, doctors uh, David Hett and uh, Max Jonas have tested this, and it has yet to fail to identify wow. a human. So in this all could eventually conditions. get you into your car. It could get you into your house. It could get you into a bank. It could get you anywhere. Anywhere. Do you know, though, I mean, anyway. I, I know I watch 24, I like it. Will this lead to, like, theft of fingers? Yeah, sounds exactly. ridiculous. No. I was going to say that. I'm with you. What, you could chop your finger off, you know, and well, somebody could use... I, as I said earlier, the, the near-infrared light is going through the top of the finger and oh. it's highlighting the veins. So if you be... sever a finger, uh -huh. the so. haemoglobin will exit the veins. It will be no good to anyone. If so they use you... it on ATMs, though, I won't be able to send my daughter out with my car to, you know, to the cash uh, Not that you should do that. Not that you should do that anyway, Sue, but... Stop to that. So can I... Can I see if it works now? Yes, then? of course. If we just scan and identify and you okay, insert put your my index finger, finger in here, and it says, and there it goes. Comes yeah. up with it's come up with my. Let me swivel that round. There you go. So it's come up with my. Oh, you've got the full frame there. There it is. You've got the full frame. You can frame. see that it's identified me ident uh, immediately. Yes. Uh, the other thing, of course, we can do is set your left index finger, and you just scan. No, your left Different index one. finger. <laughs> All right. Sorry. And as soon as you've scanned it, it's registered it. Now what I'll do is just set your left index finger uh, as a threat indicator. So next time, if somebody is asking you to open up with, at gunpoint or forcing you, now put your left finger yes, in. Yes, well, of course, I'm just going to put that one in because you don't know which one I've oh, had wow. registered. And it now says a threat indicator for Philip Schofield has been identified. Now, if this was on an access control and we do put these in high net worth properties, yeah. the client is opening up the door silently, but we've now activated a police alert uh, oh, you know, wow. through to That's everyone. Oh, I love a bit of tech. Oh, I love a bit I of like tech. Well, Thank you, Roberto. This stage, it hasn't been rolled Thank out. You. No. You know, police aren't rolling it out. It's obviously technology for the future. So uh, it, it was used yeah. in the Olympic Sioux, as you yeah. know, and uh, it's been used yeah, in, exactly. in a number of locations. Yeah. Yeah. Fascinating. Fascinating. Love it. And thank technology. you for bringing it on. Thank you. Thank, thank you very you for much for inviting me.